Today we will reflect on the life of St. John of Capistrano, Confessor. This saint's life is an apt illustration of the inscrutable ways of divine providence. Born on the 24th of June 1386 at Capistrano in the Abruzzi mountains of central Italy to a baron named Antony, he studied both civil and canon law at per Perugia brilliant success and at the age of 27 was appointed governor of Perugia, then papal or part of the papal states. He was successful in combating civic corruption but in 1416 when the city was captured by the Mala Testa and John went to entreat for peace, he was cast into a dungeon. His imprisonment caused him to consider seriously the state of his own soul and when he was released he made up his mind to abandon the world entirely in obedience to Saint Francis who had appeared to him in a dream. John entered the Franciscan order on the 4th of October 1415. He was ordained as a priest in 1425 and began his preaching career which took him to many of the principal cities of Italy. So outstanding was his success that before long the largest churches could not contain his hearers and he would preach to some 20,000 to 30,000 in the open squares. Great miracles of healing accompanied his preaching and further spread his fame abroad so that on one occasion he was asked to make the sign of the cross over some 2,000 sick who had been brought to the mission. Like his mentor, Saint Bernardin of Siena, his strong Christian optimism drove him to battle problems at all levels with the confidence emanating from a deep faith in Christ. Saint John breathed his last on the 23rd of October 1456 and was canonized by Pope Alexander VIII on the 16th of October 1690.